Corvallis is painted red, white, and blue today for the 100th annual Memorial Day Parade. This year's theme, be the one to stop veteran suicide. Today's not about me, it's about the ones that didn't come home, and that's who I'm here to honor and respect. As a tribute to those who served the United States and passed away, the streets in Corvallis were lined with American flags. The Main Street Parade featured servicemen and women, local organizations, and a whole fleet of motorcycles, horses, tractors, and vintage cars. Among the patriotic colors were veterans from various military branches. Warren Ewalt served 24 years in the Marine Corps. He was honored to be in the parade alongside a World War II vet. A lot of times today I have thought about some of those brothers and sisters that didn't make it back. And I, I had to fight back a tear a couple of times. And, and then those ones that did make it back, but didn't make it after they got back, I think about them also. For Anthony C. Malley, serving was his true calling. I was born a Marine. <laughs> Anthony grew up in New York during World War II. He would hang on the fence of the Navy Yard to watch the Marines in their dress blues. Being at the parade is a special occasion for him. I'm proud to be here and it reminds me of uh, my service time through the comradeship that uh, is extended here. Being in Montana now, Anthony feels connected to the community of veterans. But some veterans after coming home struggle with PTSD. And many of these heroes even go as far as taking their own lives to end the suffering. That's why Corvallis themed this parade, Be the One. The community wants to help be the one to put an end to veteran suicide. It's a cause that's near and dear to me. I've known Marines that have taken their own life and that's such a tragedy. To learn more about Be The One, go to kpax.com. In Corvallis, Emily Brown, MTN News.